Hello my learning and technology friends, my name is Frank and I'm glad that you're here. Today we're going to look at a new feature in the Microsoft Whiteboard that is extremely useful, especially if I'm presenting a whiteboard and I want people to follow along as I move to different parts of the whiteboard. It's called Follow Me. Let's go have a look. Here I am in a meeting with Bruce and I want Bruce to follow along as I move to different parts of the whiteboard. So if I click on my name, I'm going to go in and say everyone follow me. What's going to happen is Bruce will receive a notification that I would like him to follow me and you'll notice that a pink border goes around the whiteboard so I can see that I've got everybody following me. Bruce is going to accept that follow me request and now you can see that Bruce is following me. So Bruce Wayne is following me. If I move along on the whiteboard, what's going to happen is anything that I go to or center on will show up on Bruce's screen. If I scroll in and out to make things larger or smaller, that will also happen on Bruce's screen as well. This is incredibly useful, especially if I have a class of students and I wanna move around a larger whiteboard and focus on different areas, I can get the entire class or anyone that I'm presenting to, to follow along as I move around and demonstrate different concepts and work on different parts of the whiteboard. If they want to, they can stop following me. And then when I'm done, I can go to my name and do the stop follow me feature and everybody can now roam the whiteboard on their own. Now we have a feature that's very useful for when I'm presenting or when I'm doing any type of classroom work and I want to make sure that both remote students and students that are in the classroom but connected to the whiteboard on their screens will actually see exactly what I'm presenting. So the follow me feature is a very useful feature that I think you'll like using. Uh, comment down below what you think of this feature. Give this video a thumbs up if it was useful for you. And there's some other videos on other features of the Microsoft Whiteboard, an entire playlist about the Microsoft Whiteboard, and even a complete tutorial if you want to start from scratch.